Hello everyone, how to simplify this nice algebraic expression? So if we have 29 to the power of 5 plus 29 and we write this algebraic expression into the simplified form. Uh, so here you remember one thing is that calculator is not allowed in this problem. It means that we need to show all of the working on this paper. Uh, so uh, here I hope so you like this method but if you, uh, you have any other method in your mind please don't hesitate to write this method into the comment section. So here uh, uh, please write this method uh, without using the calculator okay so uh, you, uh, you can just write into the comment section which method in which you cannot use the calculator okay. So uh, the very first step we are going to do is first we need to uh, focus on the exponent of this term. So the exponent of this term is 5 and uh, we rewrite this 5 as this is 20 to the power uh, 29 to the power 5. We break this 5 as 4 plus 1 and this is over plus 29. And now here in the next step we need to apply here the nice exponent law. You know that if you have a to the power of m plus n equals to a to the power of m multiplied by a to the power of n so that we uh, use this exponent law here uh, in the first term so uh, our first term is written as 29 to the power of 4 multiplied by 29 to the power of 1 plus this is over 29 and now here further in the next step uh, we uh, need to take common 29 from both of these terms and we get the remaining values are here you get 29 to the power of 4 plus here we get uh, 1 only uh, and now further in the next step uh, here we uh, we need to focus on this 29 to the power of 4 term so that uh, we just write this 29 to the power of 4 as in this form 29 into uh, we write it as 29 to the power of 4 we break it as 29 to the power of 2 multiplied by 2 plus uh, we write this is 1 and here we use another exponent law you know that if you have a to the power of m multiplied by n we write it as a to the power of m and its whole power is n. So according to this exponent law here we just move this 2 inside the term and it will be written as 29 times of uh, 29 square and its whole square plus this is over 1. And now here further in the next step uh, in order to move forward uh, we first need to find the value of uh, this 29 square. Uh, and uh, now first we can find uh, this value 29 square so this 29 square means that uh, here we take uh, this part of this expression we can just take the base of this term that is 29 square so now we break this 29 square as uh, 29 multiplied by 29 uh, and here further we need more simplifications and uh, we write this 29 as uh, 20 plus 9 uh, and now we break this we multiply this 29 both of these terms separately and we write it as 29 times of 20 plus 29 times of 9. So you remember that because calculator is not allowed in this problem so that we need all of these uh, steps but uh, some viewers uh, just tell us into the comment section that uh, these are the uh, uh, is reasonable steps okay uh, but some users comment that these are the time wasting uh, steps but now if in your exam calculator is not allowed then uh, you you can do all of these steps okay uh, so for so that's why i can do this uh, solution uh, step by step form so here uh, we now first multiply this 29 with the 20 now we consider this is 29 and uh, we can just uh, consider this is two digit number when you multiply this zero with this number uh, we obtain here uh, zero and when you multiply two with this number you get two nines are 18 we write eight and carry one two two is a four four plus one is five here we multiply nine with 29 you get nine nines are 81 we write one and carry eight nine twos are 18 18 plus eight becomes 26 so here we need to sum up these two values so 0 plus 1 becomes 1 
8 plus 6 becomes 14 we write 4 and carry 1 5 plus 2 is 7 7 plus 1 is 8 so it means that a 29 square equals to 840 in one so here uh, we move backward and we uh, copy down and uh, this uh, uh, expression here okay so we first copy down this expression it is 29 times of 29 square and its whole square plus 1 and here we will replace the value of 29 square it will be written as 29 multiplied by when you put this value it will be written as 841 square plus 1 uh, and now here uh, our next claim is to find the value of 841 square so 841 square means that we multiply 841 with 841 and at the last we add one here uh, so here first we need to multiply these two values so that we break this 841 as 800 plus 40 and plus 1 and this is our plus 1 so now we can uh, multiply this 841 separately each of these values and it will be written as uh, 841 multiplied by 800 plus 841 multiplied by 40 plus 841 multiplied by 1 become this value and at the last we add 1 here okay so for then the next step we need all of these uh, multiplications so here first we will multiply these two values and we have this is 29 times we consider this is three digit number and this is one digit number when you multiply this zero with this number we will get zero when you multiply this number with zero you get zero and now we multiply eight with these three numbers you get eight ones are eight eight fours are 32 we write two and carry three eight eights are 64 64 plus three becomes 67 plus here we again multiply this number with this so when you multiply 0 with this number you get 0 and when you multiply 4 with this number you get 4 ones are 4 4 4 the 16 we write 6 and carry 1 4 8 the 32 32 plus 1 becomes 33 and 841 plus 1 equals to 842 so in the next step we first need to uh, sum up all of these values and uh, you add these values first we have 0 plus 0 plus 2 equals to 2 and this 0 plus 4 becomes 4 4 plus 4 becomes 8 8 plus 6 becomes 14 14 plus 8 becomes 22 we write 2 and carry 2 so this 2 plus 3 is 5 5 plus 2 is 7 and 7 plus 3 is 10 we write 0 and carry 1 and 6 plus 1 becomes here 7 so here at the last we multiply 29 with this number so that here we break this 29 as first we write this number 707282 we write 29 as 20 plus 9 and now here we multiply this number with both of these values so you have 707282 multiplied by 20 plus 707282 multiplied by 9 so here we consider this is one number this is two digit number so 0 multiplied by this number you get 0 and 2 2 is a 4 2 8 is a 16 now we write uh, 2 8 the 16 we write 6 and carry 1 2 2 the 4 4 plus 1 is 5 2 7 the 14 we write 4 and carry 1 2 0 the 0 0 plus 1 is 1 2 7 the 14 plus we multiply 9 with this number 9 2 the 18 we write 8 and carry 1 9 8 the 72 72 plus 1 is 73 we write 3 and carry 7 so 9 2 is 18 18 plus 2 becomes 25 we write 5 and carry 2 9 7 is 63 63 plus 2 becomes 65 we write 5 and carry 6 9 0 is 0 0 plus 6 is 6 and 9 7 is again 63 so here we need to uh, sum up these two values so 0 plus 8 equals to 8 4 plus 3 is 7 6 plus 5 is 11 we write 1 and carry 1 5 plus 5 is 10 10 plus 1 is 11 we write 1 and carry 1 4 plus 6 is 10 10 plus 1 is 11 we write 1 and carry 1 
so 1 plus 3 is 4 4 plus 1 is 5 and 6 plus 4 is 10 we write 0 and carry 1 so 1 plus 1 is 2 so this is our final answer of this question and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos